Okay, now we can continue. I notice he's playing the hi-hat here, but every other hi-hat would be a little quieter. So again, using the velocity at the bottom of the screen, I can give it that effect. That sounds good. Now I could draw in more, but by using the select tool, I can select and drag and drop. Now I'll finish drawing in the kick drum and the snare drum. Let's solo that much and have a listen to what we've got so far. Notice it doesn't sound exactly like the original, but that's MIDI. And with MIDI you can change the sounds later. If you have better drum sounds, we can use them. Let me continue by dragging and dropping some more of this into place. It's a fairly basic drum beat that he has throughout this song, so what I'm going to do just to get started is I'll copy that much, those two bars we just made, and then by putting the cursor on this bar, I'll paste them there. I don't have to paste them individually because sonar gives me the chance to give it repetitions here, and I'll crank that way up by using the right button. I can go ten at a time. By zooming out, we'll see that there's plenty of drums there now, and those will just go on and on. I'll have to take some out and change them up as we go along, but for the sake of this, I'll move along now and go to the next instrument. I'll mute those drums out for now and go back to using our reference. Let's have a look now at the bass. I've set these tracks up in advance, so this it's going to be a bass guitar here now. I can slide the notes around, find the right key that it's in, and find out where to begin. The first thing I hear I'm doing... Oh, I think we might be down a little too low here. Let's have a listen. He's going... Dum, 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 dum. Bring it up that octave. Oops, that's too close. Move it over there. There's what I hear him doing. Again, we're not hearing my bass, we're only hearing his, but, but visually we're seeing mine. Let's hear ours now. Again, not exact, but I think that'll work. I'll go back out to my main screen, and again, I'll copy that whole bar. And drag and drop it. Aw, oh, heck, I might as well copy it and paste it and be done with it. Again, I'll have to change it up later, but this is just to, to give you an idea how this process goes. And that's a basic bass line. Now let's move on to the guitar. I hear the guitar kind of bringing this song. 